The following contest is a triple threat Hell in a Cell match. Making his way to the ring from New York, weighing in at 198 pounds, Santana. The feeling, the electricity in the arena right now is unlike anything I've ever felt in quite some time. This match is going to be good. He calls himself the standard bearer of this division and plans on proving it in a matter of moments. Lucha! Lucha! And his opponents, first, from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 168 pounds, Kalisto! Calls himself the GLOAT, greatest lucha of all time. He's not even the greatest luchador on my screen right now. He believes he is better than the rest of the lucha house party. And Kalisto, for his size, has accomplished so much. He doesn't realize that he's five foot four and only weighs 175 pounds. Pretty has entered the building. And from seasonal residences, weighing in at 212 pounds, Tyler Breeze. He owns many homes around the world. Tyler Breeze, very accomplished superstar here in WWE, teaming with Fandango to form the uh, Fashion Police. You know, guys, Breeze flew here on a private jet direct from Milan just to grace the WWE Universe with his presence. Oh, what a nice guy. Maybe he could give you some fashion tips, Byron. <laughs> whoa, whoa, that's not cool. Why would you say something like that? Because it's true. I have sources. You have lies. I did, but I'm glad I get paid to talk about it now. I mean, Hell in a Cell is carnage. Hell in a Cell is pandemonium. Superstars yeah. know they must enter a Hell in a Cell with a different mindset and be a version of themselves they have never been before. Remember, anything goes, but the only way to win is pinfall or submission in the ring. He is coming up the engine. He's not going to let anything stop him. And now in the most dangerous area inside the cell. Mistiming with that springboard. He's got his hands on a sledgehammer. Total of chaos is about to be unleashed. Cover, cover. Immediately powers out. I think this ref might be a little slow on the count. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. from the spotlight. This is the time to take it. The sound of this crowd is deafening, and he's asking for more. Consecutive attacks keeping Breeze off his game. Kalisto staying true to his game plan here. 
Face for a turnbuckle. He's getting a little batter now. Ooh -hoo. He's been placed in the corner now. One takes a lot in a match like this. Using the elbow as a weapon. Oh, the sledgehammer connects. That'll scramble your insides. Just one right after the other can't be stopped. This is just getting uncomfortable at this point. This has to be stopped. The cumulative damage here is going to have long-term effects. See that coming. Short of the Crowd the opposition. Wow! Springboard misses the target. He leaves the ring and there's no countouts in this one. He climbs into the ring. Boom! Oh, and the reversal by Tyler Breeze. Overhand connects. behind it. Oh, jump shattered. Oh, Breeze 
fights back. Boom. Oh shit, 
breaker. Guys, we can see the top of the cell breaking apart. Somebody has got to get them down before things go south in a hurry. Elbow smash. He's staring his opponent down, getting into that zone. Every foul on top of the cell is like putting your flesh through a meat grinder. for Tyler. Look 
got him totally vibing with the WWE Universe right now. Oh, oh my look at goodness. This. From the ground up. Superhuman. Oh, my gosh, this is making the hair on my neck stand up. A nervous energy has come across this arena as war is waged. Let's do this. Oh, my God. No. Oh, my God. He has a family. He has a future. Why would he do that? Let's hope there is no long-term damage, Byron. Oh, 
from behind. Oh, wow. Steiner. Nice. Kalisto turns it around. And there's the cover. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. I don't either. Can this one even count? Now he's slow to get up here, Saxton. Oh, my God. He took a massive plunge. We knew this was going to be a vicious match, but these superstars are taking it above anyone's expectations. Proving Hell doesn't need to stay in the confines of the cell. Hell can go anywhere. The final cut. Perfectly executed. Remember, though, in many cases, cut. And here we go. Locked in. It's locked in. And now looking to get locked in. They'll do a lot of damage, though. Whoa, this is surprising, Byron. Yeah. Warm up the engine on the ambulance. I got a very bad feeling about where these can... What are these in for? Yet another big move, guys. Boom, Jack. Boom, right to the yard. sure he knows what year it is. There's some power behind that punch. How can it even compete up there? How are they not frozen with fear? When you hold this much contempt for your opponent, you'll do anything you have to to drag him to hell. He's staring his opponent down, getting into that zone. I must say, he's got impressive climbing skill. You're the best guy. Warm up the engine on the ambulance. I got a very bad feeling about where these competitors are going to end up soon. He's reached the top. Take this. Boom, right across the 
small of the back. My gosh, this is making the hair on my neck stand up. A nervous energy has come across this arena as war is waged on top of the cell. Oh, you can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. Dodge, what a cue. Training's paying off. He creates space with his legs. We knew what we were in for with this matchup, but we didn't think the hell was going to be let loose above the cell. Got the leg. Oh, a dragon screw. That'll destroy a knee. Oh, my God. We can't take any more of that. This must be over. Both wrists captured. And that was nasty. You could hear the chest. victory in this triple threat match to win a triple threat match you need incredible skill instincts or luck dare i say tonight's winner showed all three in victory